Hey, this is CJ with iFixAZ. Um, I've been having problems getting the MMS working on Sprint iPhones that were flashed over to Cricut. Um, the software and the packages and everything else were already built in that were out are out on the internet right now are all for Verizon phones. So I had to take them and kind of uh, repackage them a little bit to make it work on a Sprint phone. So I'm going to show you here today how to get your MMS working on a on a uh, flashed, flashed uh, Sprint iPhone over to Cricut. This phone right now, the data works on it. So, what I'm going to do is first go into Cydia here. Actually, let me go back. Real quick. I'm just going to show you here messages. Oh, well, I did have a failed message in there. Um, right now, I, I could send you another message. It, it, they're going to fail. But if we go to settings right now, general, about, and we look down here at carrier, it's going to still say Sprint 12.0. When uh, we get done, it's going to say my little custom cricket message. So that's how we know this worked, and your MMS will work. So what I'm going to do is go to Cydia. And I gotta add. We have to add a repo. I don't know whose repo this is. I found it on cricketusers.com. Um, thanks to whoever it is, and uh, you know, thanks for letting me use it, letting all of us use it. So we're gonna go to manage. We're gonna go to sources. We're gonna get edit and add. We're gonna type in v backspace. All these links will be down in the signature, so you can just copy and paste them as well. In the description, I mean, that's the signature. So it's vbackspace.jp uh, slash repo. I'm going to add that source. And that source gives us access to the comm center patch. Uh, there, there's other sources out there that have it on it. Um, the comm center patch, what it does is let you let the iPhone read unsigned character carrier bundles so this way we can actually edit the MMS settings in the sprint part and uh, your phone will not sit there and t you know it, it won't do anything if, if this comm center patch is uns if you don't install the comm center patch it'll just sit there and say it's searching for signal because it won't take the the file because they're unsigned so I'm gonna return to Cydia I'm going to search, search for com, enter patch. I'm going to hit install. So my iPhone's going to be reloading now. I have to come out of the screenshot over here because I can't uh, I can't uh, do the screenshot. And uh, iFunbox at the same time. Um, iFunbox is a, a file explorer. Uh, I'm always going to assume. I'm always going to assume your iPhone is already jailbroken. Obviously, if you've gotten this far, your phone's already jailbroken. Um, iFunbox, I will add a link down to the bottom again. This is great software that you can edit the file system and do all kinds of crazy things to your iPhone. So if you don't already have it, go download it. You'll need it later. So we're going to go into raw file system here. We're going to go to system, library carrier bundles iPhone and on this one we're looking for Sprint US bundle um, on the 
Verizon version, it's Zeppelin underscore US bundle that you need to edit. But on this one, it's a sprint, so we're editing the sprint bundle. So we're going to go in here, and uh, I'm going to open up this carrier.plist file real quick. Because in this carrier.plist file are all the existing stock sprint settings. So if we go down here to MS, MMSC, you're going to see that there's an HTT MMS sprint.pcs, blah, 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 blah. You can look at the file I, I, I am going to link to and just manually edit your file if you, you choose to. If not, what I just do is this. I, I go copy from PC. I've been, uh, I've been doing quite a bit here, so I've missed... There it is, Sprint working in MS. I'm going to upload this one. But basically, all it's going to contain is a carrier and a version file because that's all you need. Um, everything else, if your phone has already been flashed and everything else is working, then I wouldn't care if you need to do your PRL file or anything else. There's already tutorials on how to flash your phone to make that work. This is just to get the MMS working. So I'm going to hit open. And that's it. This phone needs to be reset now, um, so I'm going to pause the video um, so I can show you the rest of it. Okay, I've just hard or I've just uh, powered my phone off and powered it back on. Um, I'm in general settings and about, and as you can see, the carrier is now on Cricut 12.0. That's how you can check and make sure that your file has has updated and it will do what you want it to do. So at this point in time, MMS is working on this phone. I have them going back and forth. Um, but also, if you want to take a look here, on this is the other carrier uh, .plist file that I've made. That is the custom edited one for Sprint. You know, you see that the MMSC is now here the size message size and everything else is all set up for cricket so if you don't want to and of course i've gotten interrupted for a thousandth time because i'm taking phone calls and everything else but you can of course just make your carrier peelless file look like mine or you can or you can just copy and paste them if you have any questions or comments please leave them in the video and uh, check out ifixaz.com thank you very much Goodbye.